Instinctively, I jumped to the floor. When I opened the door and saw everyone running, that one, you know, really occurred to me that a, a shootout went down. A scary scene in Central City. Four people shot, including a 16-year-old boy who's now in the hospital. They didn't have any regard for anyone that, that today. It's just scary. It is scary. The crime scene stretched from 2000 Washington Avenue down to 2100 4th Street outside Kyle Wagaspak's home. I'm just glad that no one in my house got hurt. We have a little boy coming and and now we can't we can't just pack up and move because we bought the house, but it is kind of a little scary that it's this close to home. Kyle helping his neighbor clean out her car after bullet holes shattered her rear window and went straight through her trunk. Overall, eight people have been shot in New Orleans in the last 24 hours. Intense crime infestation, a lot of drugs, narcotics violence. Candace McMillan is a landlord and contractor on 4th Street. She says she's always trying to offer work for those who need it to try and keep them from turning to crime for cash. Many of them just come to me saying, hey, listen, I have a criminal record. I've been filling out job applications. Nobody will hire me. Nobody will give me a chance. And a lot of times what they need is quick cash and they're going to get it one way or another. Of the four victims that were involved in the shooting, that teenager was shot in the arm along with another man. One person shot in the chest, another person shot in the ankle. No word on their current conditions as of right now. But if you have any information on a suspect, you can call the NOPD or you can call Crime Stoppers anonymously. That number, 504-822-1111. Live outside of NOPD headquarters tonight, Juliana Mazza, WDSU News. All right.